We're going to put on tap shoes. Seattle also needs more artistic expression in its parks, says Monique Franklin. Five, six, seven, eight, shuffle, step. Her company, Inspired Child, is one of dozens that's part of a $340,000 joint effort between Parks and Rec and the Office of Arts and Culture called Put Art in the Parks. Yo, words like liberty. There's poetry here at Judkins Park in the Central District and hands-on art and dancing too, as Franklin encourages children to celebrate their heritage. Say it loud! It's part of the city's larger plan to use stronger, more culturally sensitive programs to bring more people to Seattle's parks and invite all of us to join the ongoing effort of making Seattle a healthy place to be. Part of activating the parks is really about drawing people out into the community where community building can happen, where relationship buildings can happen, and, and that's going to create a healthier community. Yes.